baada ya taarifa kuhusu kutoweka kwa sukari yenye sumu ambayo ililetwa humu nchini mwaka wa 2018 na viwango vyake vya ubora kutiwa doa na shirika la KEBS Rais William Ruto aliwachisha kazi maafisa 27 wa mashirika ya serikali ikiwemo wale wa mamlaka ya KRA The entity that was procured to do or Hileo kamati ya bunge ya uwekezaji ikiongozwa na mbunge wa Pokot Kusini David Kusing ilitaka kubaini ni vipi mamlaka ya KRA ilihusika na iwapo ililegeza kamba na kuhatarisha maisha ya wakenya Our role is to ensure if these goods are going to to vine park then they are sealed from the port so by the time they are released by the multi agency the multi age us carry seals it seals the containers um multi agency provides oversight for these goods and this, these goods are escorted taratibu ni kuwa bidhaa zisizofikia viwango vya ubora huharibiwa ama kurejeshwa kwa taifa zilizoagizwa kwa gharama ya mwagizaji chini ya ushauri wa mwanasheria mkuu uamuzi wa kuharibu sukari hiyo ya sumu ulihusisha sukari hiyo kutumika kutengenezea ethanoli kwa matumizi ya uzalishaji hata hivyo sukari haijulikani ilikopelekwa kwani haikuharibiwa kama ilivyoagizwa KRA imesisitiza kuwa ilitekeleza wajibu wake isipokuwa vitengo vya usalama now when the goods arrive remember our seal the custom seal says the goods are coming from the port to vine park So for us in terms of breaking the seal the goods have arrived. And these goods at that point now customs has pulled back. I think the scabs involvement as well because of the nature of the goods and then the goods were transported to King's Commodities. And this now was under the security arms in terms of protection of King's Commodities. Uchunguzi wa kujua sukari ilikopelekwa unaendelea. David Kagina K24 Nairobi